The center has targeted to find a permanent solution to the Assam Mizoram boundary dispute by March 2021. And this was informed by Union's Joint Secretary in charge at Northeast, Satendra Garg, who called on Mizoram Governor Sridharan Pillay and Chief Minister Zoram Thanga in state capital Aizol today. Garg further informed that a Joint Secretary level officer will be deputed full time by the center to work on the Assam Mizoram border dispute. Both Assam and Mizoram will also appoint their respective nodal officers to assist the central official. And this comes as a big assurance at a time when multiple flare ups have been witnessed in the interstate border between both states. All right, so indeed a big story at this point in time, viewers. The center has targeted to find a permanent solution to the Assam Mizoram boundary dispute by March 2021. And this was informed by Union Joint Secretary in Charge Northeast, Satendra Garg, who called on Mizoram Governor Sridharan Pillay and uh, Chief Minister Zoram Thanga in state capital, Aizol, today. And Garg further informed that a Joint Secretary level officer will be deputed full time by the center to work on the Assam Mizoram border dispute. And both Assam and Mizoram will also appoint their respective nodal officers to assist the central official. And well, this comes as a big assurance at a time when multiple flare ups have been witnessed in the interstate border between both states. The Government of India has appointed a Joint Secretary level officer for full time working on this dispute between Assam and Mizoram. Mm. Where Government of uh, Mizoram, Government of Assam also have made their nodal officers. Mm. And uh, uh, of course, like with security agencies will be working for a permanent solution by March 2021. Like we'll be working full time on this one and we have got a time limit that by March, uh, like we would like to resolve this issue. Uh, where Mizoram ends and where Assam starts, like these are larger issues which this committee will be looking at. And meanwhile, MHA Joint Secretary Garg also informed that the immediate concern of the centre and both state governments was to resume traffic and movement of goods trucks into Mizoram. And that has been ensured with over 100 trucks waiting to enter Mizoram and over 40 already in the state. We, our immediate concern was that uh, traffic should be restored and movement of goods, supplies and all this thing, which we have done. See, my information before I came to this meeting, like uh, vehicles are moving, uh, more than 100 vehicles are waiting to enter Mizoram because this COVID uh, screening is going on. Mm. So uh, yesterday, I mean, till morning about uh, 40 vehicles have already come to Mizoram. So like uh, traffic resumption is there already. And Garg, who also had a discussion with civil society groups in Aizol today, said the concern of the CSOs have been taken into account and the centre, along with the two states of Assam and Mizoram, are already working on some of their suggestions. Definitely whatever is happening on border, that became the main important issue. And I got, of course, their point of view. We, we have understood what civil society's point of view was there. And I explained to them, okay, like, okay, we understand your point of view. Some of the things have already been taken up at Government of India level with Government of Assam and, of course, with Government of Mizoram. And I have told them, okay, like, uh, Government of Mizoram is sensitive to what civil society have been taking. They have already taken up many, uh, largely the, all the issues with Government of India and Government of Assam. And after hectic deliberations in, in Silchar yesterday, Garg called on a Mizoram Chief Minister Zoram Thanga at his official residence in Aizol today. Garg praised uh, Chief Minister Zoram Thanga about the Home Secretary level talks held in Silchar yesterday. The MHA Joint Secretary assured Zoram Thanga that complete normalcy will be restored soon. Garg also met Governor Sridharan Pillay at the Raj Bhavan and briefed him on the developments.